Alright, so today I'm playing Subnautica Below Zero. Here we go. So, I'm going to be starting a new game completely on survival. So, I will get to you when it loads, which could be fast because I'm on one of the newer Xboxes. We are starting now. This is the farthest I can take you on We're company space, space box, Robin. You sure you want this? The research is in everything. <laughs> Uh oh. So things went wrong. We crashed. Fell onto the floor. What I was trying to do was turn down the volume of my TV, but that did not want to happen until now. So, as far as I can tell, I am currently trapped inside of this stupid pod. So, I have. I have, um. I don't need flares. So, I have played a little bit of Blue Zero, but not very much. All I really know about the game is that I spawn, like, I pretty much crash and then I jump into the ocean. I know a little bit about the story, but I'm not going to talk about that because, yeah, somebody watching might not know. So, I deleted literally everything on my phone to record this, so... Let's hope it goes well, and yeah, so I'm playing Subnautical Zero for a series, this is episode one, um, I'm gonna actually turn this down, yeah, well, no way, oh god, I'm being burnt, uh, this way, okay, did I go the right, okay, I did, this is definitely the right way, so, welcome to the world of Subnautica, I might play Subnautica after this, um, just because it's a fun game and I like it, and I wanted to play this because this is a lot newer, and is equally as fun, to be honest. In my opinion, it's quite fun. Wait, wait, okay, I am going the right way for my pod. So, I think what I'm going to try to get done in this episode is, like, get basic needs stuff, like scanner... I'm gonna need an oxygen tank. I might try to get the Z Glide, but that might not happen, because, yeah. So, I'm going to come back when I, uh, well, actually. Yeah, I'll read that later. Um, who's. Oh, that's the person. I'm pretty sure I'm. Supposed to listen to something before that because of what Lil said, but um, let's go up for air, probably is a good idea. Okay, there we go. Oh, sweet, uh, get back here. I need you. You're like water. Oh, god, he's so ugly, bro. Um, oh wow, this is beautiful. I have no clue which way I'm supposed to go to get to the kelp forest, and I know I need to go there to get stuff for my knife. Oh, I see kelp. So, I will probably play Subnautica on this channel at some point, but if I'm going to play Subnautica... Like, all the way through on the channel. I want it to be good. Because Subnautica is one of my favorite games. It's definitely better than um, Below Zero. When it comes to, like, Scare Factor and everything. Dude, you cannot see anything. Anyway. Like I was saying, it's kind of like one of those things where... It's such a good game that I don't even want to play it. Without properly playing it right so i'm going to get 
this stuff back to my base and like get a knife and then I'll check back in. Alright, so I got myself my knife and now what I'm gonna do, do, what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to go ahead. Oh jeez, it's. Okay, well, that's not really what I'm here for. So I'm going to make myself an oxygen tank because those things are really useful in this game, especially considering the fact that I have like no air on like pretty much completely ocean planet which yeah so i guess welcome to the first gaming video that's like this i'm gonna try to make this an easier thing to record but it's just not that easy because i don't because re screen recording on my xbox only lets me record for like two minutes which is kind of hard when you want to record a whole entire gameplay that I then have to download on my phone to edit. So, so what do I need now? Okay, I need to go get more titanium. So, I'm gonna go get that air tank, and I'll be back when I get it. I didn't make the fiber mesh yet. There we go. Boom. Now that we have that, I'm going to eat and drink and... Oh, that's nice. Cool. Alright, so now we're going to go get that Altera supply cache, which is over here. I don't have a scanner. That would be useful to have. I just need some titanium. Because I already made a battery. Hopefully this will give me... There we go. So now, I can go make this, and then we can head on over. Like I said, I pretty much got rid of everything on my phone for this. So, yeah. Boom. We got ourselves... Yes, you do. While I'm still here, I'm gonna go scan this, because it's, like, right in front of my house, so it'll be useful to be scanned. One out of three. Wasn't it, was it two in the last game? I can't remember. Hey, I want to scan you. I didn't even try to catch you. Just let you be free. Still barely have anything, but... 200 meters this way. Don't want to have anything in your hand when you're going to get this because sea monkeys do spawn over here and sea monkeys are annoying. Like, really annoying. I'm definitely going to have to boost the audio on this so that you can actually hear me. Um, luckily there's no Leviathan class things over here. At least last time I came over here there weren't, but there are little freezy boys, so. Hopefully the freezy guys leave me alone. Oh, jeez. This place is terrifying. I guess me thinking this is terrifying is a horrible thing, because, like, this place is nothing. Okay, there's one of these pretty close to where the base should be that I should be able to scan. Oh, a PDA. Oh, Fred. Gotta go up. Oh, this is gonna look pretty, in it? Or it's gonna look like it's snowing again. I love this game. Oh, I haven't scanned you yet? Oh, jeez, it's gonna be dark before I can get home. Well, I'm gonna find my way home. I realize this makes great content, finding my way home in the dark in Subnautica. Oh. This game is just so beautiful, even at nighttime. 
This game's a lot more easy to play during the nighttime because of all the glowy bits. The other game didn't have that really. Like the shallow area in the last game was kind of dark most of the time. I think that acid mushrooms were able to glow slightly. Always important to get the resources early game. Is that okay? So pretty much um I pretty much got everything done I wanted to get done this episode. Other than the sea glide, which I think we'll look for some more fragments for the next five minutes. And then I will also be recording part two after I get this on my SD card. And then after that, we will be able to just chill. Because I'm going to record two parts per session, pretty much. Anything down here of use? Crash fish don't spawn in these normal caves, do they? Guess not. Well, hey, quit sleeping, bud. Yeah, exactly. Dude, I am so bad at this. Oh, I should get air. want to be able to breathe, you know? Well, okay, there's a sea monkey right there. Don't want him to steal this from me. Oh, yes, that's what I want. Right there. Sweet. I'm also going to grab some, some more of those things for uh, the ribbon plants. Because those are going to be nice for battery, you know? also like how in this game I can actually see better what my battery's at. A little bit better. It's a lot easier. Hey, sea monkey. You have anything for me? You're adorable. Anyway, um, they're like the most adorable thing ever, but you know, they're literally demons. Now, if I can get the stuff for a sea glide in part two, this episode, then in part two, I will get a sea glide and probably just go resource mining. I had a friend that actually played this for, started playing this for a series, uh, yesterday. You lead already? Jeez. How far am I from my life pod? Oh god, I went way too far. I'm not comfortable with being this far out. But granted, this far out is probably the farthest out I have to go to, like, get that last little fragment. Let's go over here and see if there's anything... Fragment. That's the last fragment we need. Boom. Let's go pin this, and then we will end the video at that point. Actually, let's catch a peeper. Nice. Dude, peepers in the last game were so hard to catch, and apparently, I don't think it got any better here. Oh yeah, it's down here, isn't it? Okay, we can make the lubricant. I think we can actually make everything. Are we going to be able to end this video off? We are. I'm so much taller than this door. Anyway, thanks for watching. That's it for Subnautica Below Zero Part 1. Making sure I save on camera. I know I did it now. That's it. For this episode.